Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Melissa, for those of you who don't know. And for today's video, we're going through my trash. Yes, you heard that right. We're going to be going through my empties bin. I'm going to tell you guys the tea on all the products, whether I would repurchase it, whether I loved it, hated it, all that stuff, to give you guys my opinions on whether it's worth your money or not. So if you guys are interested in this video, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, and then also don't forget to subscribe before you go if you like what you see. And without further ado, let's go ahead and get started, guys. Right, so I'm gonna try to make this really fast. It was a horrible attempt at snapping, but I'm gonna try to make this really fast, quick. First thing, by Peace Out, the Acne Healing Dots. Yes, I've talked about this so many times on my channel. You guys need this, I'm obsessed. It is literally just a little dot. If you have a blemish, whether it's under your skin, above your skin, if you have a little blemish, all I do is take the sticker, apply it, then go to sleep, wake up the next morning. This is gonna sound nasty, but when you peel it off, it literally like peels off the gunk in the pimple with it and it does not leave any acne scars your skin will look super healthy the next day it's not like you're picking at it like there's no scars no nothing no irritation i'm a huge fan of this i've reper i've repurchased this so many times i think there's another like box of this in here that is how often i buy them but i love them if you have acne prone skin or if you have like a pimple once in a while and you just want to make it a little bit better definitely got this this works it even works for under the skin acne as well so yes i'm a huge fan if you have acne prone skin definitely check this out i love this also i'm going in no particular order i'm kind of just grabbing things and going next thing we're going to talk about is the olaplex intense repair kit i just have the little mini kit i talked about this in my recommendations i believe or best things of 2020 best things of 2020 don't want to go back there best things of 2021 and i actually really love this this made my hair so much healthier so hydrated it brought back my curls i'm obsessed i'm a huge fan of this i've loved this so much i literally went ahead and purchased the bigger one of this because my hair just loves this so so much it really repairs your hair if you have dry damaged hair bleached hair anything this is literally for you i will actually go ahead and leave this on overnight wake up the next morning and then wash it out and my hair hair just never looks better so if you need a product that is going to restore your hair make it just feel really hydrated make it look healthy make it feel healthy this is definitely it next product is this medicube triple deep erasing cream this is for all skin types so this is a makeup remover the scent i really liked it kind of smelled to me like a spot it smelled really really good i liked this i don't know if i would repurchase this i feel like it was good i love the smell but it didn't like wow me i felt like this is kind of average products that i have used before um it did not leave a film on my skin which i really appreciate so definitely a plus for this i hate having that like film feeling on my skin after I use a makeup eraser and it lasted me a little bit you really only need a little bit it melts off even your waterproof makeup as well which is great your skin will be left feeling really soft hydrated doesn't feel like it's stripping your skin I would go ahead and use this and then wash my face after but my skin really liked this it didn't break me out but it really didn't blow my socks off so i don't know if i would go to the store and definitely re repurchase this i have a few other cleansers that i want to get through but i actually did enjoy this next product which is literally like you can't even see the words of it anymore this is a kate somerville goat milk moisturizing cream i believe it is this was actually a lot more runny than i anticipated it that it was gonna be the scent, I hate it. It smelled like plastic, like chemically. I did not like the scent of it. Typically, I love Kate Somerville products, but this one, just the scent really didn't do it for me. My skin did feel really hydrated and moisturized and like glowy after I used this, which I appreciate. It did not make me feel oily. It did not make me feel greasy or heavy or anything like that. Um, my skin just felt really moisturized and makeup layered beautifully on top of this as well. So I would actually repurchase this again. The only huge con for me is just the smell but after you apply it on your face and kind of rub it in the smell does go away but um just that i was kind of like Ugh. and then another thing that really surprised me at how watery it was going to be i thought it was going to be a little bit more thick but it's extremely watery so just be careful i know when i first opened this up it kind of did come out and spill all over but um overall it was pretty good product next product which i actually have two of them i have the first aid beauty i have the ultra repair cream intense hydration and then i just have the ultra repair cream intense hydration only thing is just the packaging of it 
yes you guys need this. this is literally in every single one of my videos i'm obsessed i talk about this in my like recommendations i've talked about this in my favorites i've talked about this in my empties so many times yes 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 you guys need this if you have dry skin if you have eczema if you have cracked skin if your skin just hurts because of winter this will make such a difference in your skincare routine i use this morning and night i know when i don't use this because my skin like Sometimes I'll use Lubriderm and my skin just doesn't feel as hydrated as when I use this. My skin loves it. I use it day and night. I am obsessed. Um, so yes, you guys need this. I love this. Next product, which I believe is in another empties video, is the Bath & Body Works Aroma Therapy Sleep Lavender Plus Vanilla Pillow and Body Mist. I use this all the time. Literally every single night before I go to bed, I spray this on my bed, on my covers, and I love the smell of it. It smells like lavender. I get a little bit of a hint of vanilla, but it just feels so calming. Like spray this, put on my um, lip sleeping mask, and then I'll go into bed. And I just feel so relaxed, so calm. This has definitely helped me sleep. I feel like I just love the smell of it so much that I can't sleep without it, if that makes sense. But I'm a huge fan. I buy this all the time. Whenever there's a sale, I will like stock up on it it is just great if you guys have issues sleeping or if you guys just want a nice spray definitely check this out it's also not overpowering i have really bad allergies it does not make me like sneeze all night it just feels really really light and you're you just smell like lavender on your pillows and it's just amazing who would want that so yes you guys need this i'm obsessed with this next product we we're going to talk about let's talk about these two i have the amica bust your breast conditioner and shampoo yes i actually really love this so i used to use shimmer lights on my hair i still have some of it yes i will admit i should not be using it this is so much better shimmer lights dries out your hair if you First of all, this is a purple shampoo. So if you are blonde, this is great. It really gets rid of that brassiness. The Shimmer Lights makes my hair so dry. I used to love it. Like, I thought that was just all purple shampoos. No. This is so much better. This does not leave your hair dry. This does not leave your hair knotty. Sometimes with the Shimmer Lights, my hair would be a little bit knotty after. This makes my hair feel really hydrated, which I appreciate because when you have blonde hair, you want that extra hydration. You can leave it on for more than just like a minute and it's not going to leave your hair with that purple tint either, which is important because this is purple shampoo. Um, I would definitely repurchase this again. I wish they had like the bigger like tubes of it or whatever because this is great. Really helps my hair my hair feels really hydrated um i probably use this once or twice a month and i feel like it really does tone out my hair so my hair doesn't look really brassy um i am in need of a hair appointment so ignore my hair right now i'm actually all out of this but i'm a huge fan and i really love this next product we're going to be talking about is the dr dennis gross alpha beta universal daily peel so i only use five of these apparently you're supposed to use this for two weeks to actually see like a big difference in your skin but I've used it for five days, or I used it for five days, and I feel like I kind of noticed a little bit of a difference. My skin didn't feel dry when I used this. I feel like my skin just looked really healthy, plump, hydrated when I used this. Um, it did not irritate my skin, which is what I was nervous about. Um, so I would be interested in trying the actual, like, two-week supply of this and see how my skin likes this. This is a two-step, which I also like. Um and I feel like it just works really, really well. So this is supposed to help smooth fine lines, minimize the look of pores, improve the appearance of uneven texture and uneven skin tone. I feel like my texture definitely looked a little bit better with this. Um, and even like some of my unevenness, I feel like sometimes I have like redness over here and it definitely helped with that as well. So if you are on the market, I feel like when I did use this, I did notice a little bit of a difference. Again, it was only for a five days. So I'm interested to see how it's going to be for two weeks, but I would definitely repurchase the two weeks of this. Next product, I think this is like the biggest empties that I've done. Cause typically I leave it about 10 or so products and this is more than 10 and I'm so proud of myself. Sometimes I'm just like, I need to get rid of it. Next product we're gonna talk about is the Ulta Beauty Detoxifying Himalayan Salt Body Scrub. This is made with Himalayan salt, sweet almond oil and shea butter so i used this i actually liked what it did like it exfoliated my skin i use exfoliators like all over especially on my back sometimes when i break out using exfoliator helps me not break out but like i just 
hated the scent of this like I don't know what it is but the scent I just could not stand so it took me a little bit to get through it I'm very happy that I did and I will not be repurchasing this just because of the scent it did its job but just the scent turned me off so much I don't know what it was maybe it was a him like I have used Himalayan salt before but it was just something with this where I just could not stand so um I would definitely love to try another version of this if they have this in like a different scent or something like that but just getting this again I would not I would not do it just the scent was a big turn off for me but on the other hand I have the soap and glory buff and ready scented with magnific cocoa coconut and clean body scrub yes this is so much better I love the scent of it like I literally use this up clean it is amazing it really also did help with exfoliating all over my body it didn't feel really really harsh on my skin but it did really help with all of my breakouts that I had on my back or if I had any other breakouts just made my skin feel really really soft and supple as did the Ulta one but this scent I just loved I loved this one so much better yes I will purchase this again I love this I told you guys I had another pack yes here we go I have another pack this one is full uh, with all of the empty um, stickers in here but yes again you guys know I already talked about this yes it's yes acne prone skin definitely get it you will thank me later I still have more products okay here's another first aid beauty product so this is the ultra repair lip therapy repair dry lips I use this till the end as you guys can see I love this it really helped to moisturize my lips I use this every single night um even sometimes during the day my skin my lips just felt really really hydrated when I wore this it felt like a thick mask on my lips which I like I just felt really really hydrated really supple so yes a thousand percent I love this would definitely get it and um if you guys are on the market for a lip sleeping mask definitely check them out first aid beauty has done wonders for my skin so i would repurchase this two products that we have is the tatcha the silk cream and tatcha the dewy skin cream so I have used both of these I actually love both of them I would repurchase them again uh, the dewy skin one I feel like the dewiness lasted a little bit longer both of these all you need is just a little bit to lather up your whole entire face and a little bit goes a long way but yeah I feel like the dewy one my skin kind of looked dewy and really glowy and hydrated all day uh, the silk cream I feel like my skin felt really hydrated all day but the dew just wasn't there all day compared to the dewy one um i feel like you can't go wrong with either of them i'm a huge fan i would re repurpose why do i keep on saying repurpose i would repurchase both of these because these are amazing um the dewy one is made for dry skin and then the silk cream is made for normal to dry skin so it makes sense that the dewy one you kind of see that glow for a little bit longer but both of them i would go ahead and repurchase again a 10 out of 10 love tatcha love their products so yes we have four more products left Woo! okay next up i have the inky list back Chulio. i have no idea how to say that i'm not even i'm not even gonna lie no idea how to say this word but it is a moisturizer i actually did like this um i feel like my skin was definitely more hydrated with the tatcha products it did its job i feel like this had also like a weird scent my boyfriend used this and he was like oh no it doesn't really smell weird versus when i use it like it smells a little weird maybe i'm just like sensitive to scents but even when i smell now I'm like it kind of smells weird like not bad but it smells different there definitely is like some type of fragrance there um I don't think I would repurchase this I feel like I have other moisturizers that really make my skin feel really really hydrated this was good um it just for me I like an intense hydration I want my skin to feel really hydrated glowy and dewy throughout the day and really like absorb into my skin and can kind of see my skin looking hydrated unfortunately for me this did not do that it kind of just made my skin feel hydrated and that was it like i really didn't feel anything extra so um i would not repurchase this the next product is a little baby one this is the glam glow bright eyes i actually really liked this i feel like my under eyes felt really really hydrated when i used this again it was only the little bit of a size so i only got maybe about two weeks not even two weeks out of this but my under eyes felt really hydrated um i have this thing where my under eyes compared to the rest of my face are dry for some reason this did not make my under eyes feel really dry it made my makeup sit beautifully on top of it my skin felt really hydrated even with 
concealer on top my skin just felt really really nice so I'm a huge fan I would probably purchase the bigger one of these um, but I feel like ultimately my heart kind of goes with the Kiehl's vitamin C one but this is a good runner up my under eyes felt really really hydrated and as far as the brightening effect my under eyes didn't really look a lot brighter they just felt really hydrated and I kind of saw like a little bit of like Im Illuminosity, but it wasn't like wow. I purchased it just for the brightness. Two product, two hair care products. Okay, first one I have is the It's a Ten Miracle Leave In product. This I actually really liked. It really helped to make hair look not frizzy. It really helped to just be able to comb through my hair without any of like those really big tangles. Um, I really liked how when I used this, my hair looked pretty shiny as well. This is supposed to help with split ends and breakage. I'm not exactly sure. I actually don't really have too many split ends, um, even when dyeing my hair or anything like that. So I don't know if this is like a huge part of it. Um, I have used other hair care products as well, but I would definitely repurpose, repurchase this. This is affordable. I really like it. I really like the scent. It doesn't weigh your hair down, which I like either. And I have pretty like thick, curly, this is it natural hair, and it has worked really, really well for me. I used to use this back in the day too, and I feel like this is a product that I could just buy and be fine with. I feel like this is a repur repurchase for me and it just makes my hair just feel so much better and then the last product that I have is the Briogeo farewell frizz leave-in conditioning spray I have a few of these I actually really really like them my hair feels so hydrated when I use this same with the it's a 10 my hair feels really hydrated it does not weigh my hair down it's very easy to just comb out my hair after I shower um, to me it kind of works as also like a detangler it really helps to brush out those knots that I have just Briogeo in general I feel like is really good for my hair and it also really helps my hair not feel or look as dry which I like um, because I do bleach my hair my hair can sometimes feel or look really dry this helps to really fight that so it doesn't look really dry um, it does also add a little bit of like shiny healthiness to my hair which I appreciate so yes I would purchase this again but guys that is it we went through my entire trash I can finally throw this out thank you guys so so much for watching have you guys tried any of these products please let me know what have you gone through recently that I need to try I definitely want to hear you guys and thank you guys so much for watching if you guys did enjoy please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe before you go if you do like what you see so you can be part of the ATFB fam ATFB all things fashion and beauty and if you hit that post notification bell you will get notified of all my future uploads I try to upload at least once a week but I hope that you guys are doing well and that you guys are safe and I will see you guys in a few days in my next video bye